Hello everyone, my name is Nitsie Atamenwon and today I will talk about my instructional design treatment which is on a social media training course. I will also talk about my research plan which is focused on exploring adult learners attitude towards social media. Like I said, I'm designing a social media course so obviously important to research certain things about social media and about the targeted learners before creating a course. For example, I'm going to ex um, research the, the targeted adults learners attitude towards social media and the perception of social media um, so I can decide what to include in the course I'm designing. So I decided to create this social media course because I work in the communications department for a school district and I noticed how different departments run their own social media accounts that don't really uphold the brand of the school. For example, the soccer team have their own Twitter account and they post you know, without a structure. They post whatever picture. It's not really a good picture. You know, The language they use on social media might not be the best. So I figured it would be nice to train the staff as in charge of different social media accounts in the school district so they can properly manage social media. So my audience is primarily coaches, teachers, administration, and other staff members of school district. Um, this course will teach them how to better manage social media platforms for their respective teams and department. Um, this course could also be modified to be used in classrooms as well. So the members of my team will include a photographer, somebody with a journalism background, a digital media strategist or something similar, and a graphic designer. So this team will help me design a course that focuses on quality of a picture, quality of a video, choosing the right social media language, you know, and basic graphic design. This course will be 70% face-to-face and 30% um, online. Uh, we'll use Canvas for the online version of this course. Okay, let's talk about my research. Like my topic of inquiry says, I'm interested in knowing how familiar the targeted learners are with the tools needed to manage social media in a formal setting. And some other things I really want to know is how experienced school district employees are regarding social media management. What are the participants experience or difficulties with using social media informally? Um, the, the participants attitude towards social media in general. The participants perception of using social media professionally. My research methods are going to include survey and interview questions, survey for quantitative and interview questions for qualitative. Since we don't have much time, I'm just gonna show you some of the interview questions. Um, what social media platforms do you have and what do you use them for? What role does social media play in society right now? Has social media been making a significant impact since it was introduced or are we better off without it? What role do the current social media platforms Play in society. Please tell me about the social media platforms you have. Please describe your experience or expertise with social media. So these questions kind of tell me um, how well or how experienced they are with using social media, either formally or informally. Uh, I mean, also tells me the attitude towards social media. Um, I don't have the survey questions here, but I can use that to measure the perception and attitudes towards social media. So like I mentioned, the purpose of this study is to explore the current level of social media experience among potential participants of the social media management course that I'm designing. So I'll design this research plan as I'm designing the course. And I'm just not, I'm not only studying the social media experience, I'm also saying 
how experienced they are with taking a picture or how experienced they are with editing video or making a video or creating graphic design, basic graphic design or you know, social media language, anything that generates social media content. I will also look at my lesson plans and objectives and see how comfortable they are with the activities. I want to see how comfortable they are with using the technologies required. I know most of them are, not, are probably not proficient with Photoshop, so I've researched other software they can use. I also plan to make research on the suitable timeline for the learners to learn what this course requires. You know, how long is ideal for them to learn how to do basic graphic design? How long is it going to take them to take pictures properly? No. How long is it going to take them to learn how to edit a video and shoot a video. It's also important to study the best external resource for them for this course. For example, I like linda.com for learning. Is it going to be a good resource for them? I'll find that out. This is just a draft of my research plan. I hope to add more to it and I hope to make the best out of it. Um, thank you all for listening. Please let me know if you have any questions.